Welcome to Face to Face. Our guest today is Patrick Jerome. He is founder of Boston International Film Festival. We are going to talk to him about his journey and also this year he is going to show several Indian films in the film festival as well. Patrick, welcome to our studio. Thank you for having me. It's such a pleasure to be here After today. After talking so many years, right? At yes, home. yes, exactly. <laughs> you know, it, it is refreshing to be here. And then you've been, we, I mean, we've been presenting many Indian films through the years in the Boston International Film Festival. And this year is special, and I'm glad to be here and to talk about it. Well, you have created really an institution in the name of Boston uh, International Film Festival. Congratulations for that. Yeah, This Thank is you. your uh, 17th year. Yes, it is. I was 17 years so since we've been around. I remember when we started the film festival, we went to the city of Boston and then to uh, pitch the idea and we met with the cultural department and with the mayor Menino, uh, uh, um, you know, um, the late mayor Menino that was there at the time and then we started the process back in 2002 and here we are today uh, still, you know, doing the Boston International Film Festival. So how many films will be shown in the film festival this year? This year we're going to have about 106 films. 106? Yes, and from so many, from about 36 countries. 36 countries, mm -hmm. sure. And uh, what are the dates for the film? Um, the, the Boston International Film Festival start uh, Thursday, April 11, until uh, Tuesday, April 16. So we will play movies in about uh, five different venues. Mm -hmm. uh, the biggest one, I mean, we're going to be at the Kendall Square Cinema, Cambridge College, Bunker Hill, uh, the Community College. And we also have uh, the Old South Church that will be playing some movies as well. So, uh, and then the Regal Theater where we will have the opening night of the festival. Mm. Now, uh, after the camera, we were talking about, you mentioned that the two Indian feature films. Mm -hmm. And then also you have a couple of other small uh, short, short, films. short films there as yes. well. Uh, and uh, crew coming from those films from India? Well, Now While the Jewel is a very uh, exciting film um, about an uh, Iranian um, uh, uh, lady uh, mm -hmm. that, was, uh, that went through a process for her life to defend her life uh, after she was victim of some kind of an abuse, mm -hmm. and which is based on a true story. Mm -hmm. So we are really looking forward to present this film, which, which, which has been receiving uh, several awards uh, above, I mean, across the world, mm -hmm. especially in Europe. Mm -hmm. uh, the title of the film is Now While the Jewel, mm -hmm. and I, we are very excited to present this film here because I think it will present the spirit of the festival, and we are looking forward to that. And we have another film too, I don't know if I'm going to pronounce it well, Jalki. Oh, okay, <laughs> Jalki. Jalki. Yes. Uh, that is uh, also about uh, child abuse mm -hmm. uh, history that, it, that has been going on in India. And there's been some movement uh, to help kids uh, not to be exposed to that kind of uh, mm -hmm. reality. And uh, we are looking forward as well to present this film. It's going to be a world premiere for Jalki here Excellent. at the Boston International Film Festival. So what about some of the other countries, uh, exotic countries you have in your film festival? <laughs> well, it is amazing. We have m movies from all over Latin America. We have movies from Mexico. Uh, we are very excited to have movies as well that were made in Africa, mm -hmm. uh, like In the Name of Your Daughter, Tanzania. It's a very powerful documentary that we will be uh, playing at the festival. We have the Uganda project. So I mean, all across, you know, the, all, all the five continents, uh, we have movies playing, uh, and then that's very exciting for us because that's what Boston is all about. Boston is such a melting pot. We have people coming from everywhere, and to represent that spirits of that international cultural sharing is very important to us. So that's why we are very proud of the festival. So now, a little bit about you. Um, you are from Haiti. Yes. And uh, you made your first film as a teenager in Haiti. Yes. And you had uh, a threat to your life. That's what forced you to come to U.S. Yes. That's Tell true. about that experience and what, the, <laughs> what was the first film you made? Well, I made a first film in Haiti called Woodless Gang, mm -hmm. which was about uh, a bunch of gangsters uh, in Haiti. They call them Zenglendo, but, mm -hmm. but in the uh, English term, they are mostly, uh, they are more gangsters mm -hmm. who go to people's houses and kill people and do all different kind of um, 
uh, violent uh, abuse in the uh, population. So after I made the movie and then um, I, we had the world premiere in the movie, eight days later there was a military coup. So the system changed from mm -hmm. a democratic to a uh, military government. Mm -hmm. And then that's when, um, you know, um, you know I, they came after me and then with, you know, and I had to leave the country with, with political asylum. Sure. And of course it was very traumatic, you know, at such a young so age. So that was in 1993 you came to Boston. I came to Boston in 1993. So between 1993, yeah. now you are full time film uh, filmmaker uh, uh, filmmaker yes. and then you do this film festival every year that's correct and during this period you have made I think about 20 films about 25 films 25 films yes okay. yes I've made a lot of films but most of my stories are based on true events or inspired by true stories yeah okay. excellent uh, Patrick thank you very much for coming to our studio thank you very much and uh, all the best uh, for your film festival yes thank and, you uh, very looking much forward to working with you yes people need more information they can check our website at bifilmfestival.com or call bi the office yes or call the office at 617-482-3310 thank you very much